capillary tube of diameter one millimeter is gently inserted into a pool of a mystery liquid of density 1100 kilograms per cubic meter and a surface tension of 0 0.04 newtons meters, newtons per meter. Inside the tube, the liquid undergoes a capillary rise of five millimeters, so we have that information, which is great. What contact angle does the liquid make at the surface of the tube? So in this problem, once again, we're going to go back to page 103. We're going to pull back our capillary rise equation. Remember, it can be called capillary action as well. So I want to make sure that you all are just understanding they're all interchangeable. And no matter what verbiage the NCS decides to use on the exam, be confident in your, uh, be confident that you do know the difference between capillary rise and capillary action. It's the same thing. So once again, those are the characteristics of this particular equation. We are given, once again, the density. We're not given the specific weight, but we are given the density. We're given a capillary rise in this case, which is H, and that's five millimeters. We're given a surface tension, and we're given a diameter. I've already converted that diameter from millimeters into meters, so again, that's a very important step that you can't fail to do as well as you got to convert that uh, capillary rise. So in this case, I haven't converted it, but I do in the calculations. So again, we're going to determine our specific weight of this mystery liquid, simply the density times the local gravity. We're going to get 10791. We're going to rearrange now our equation to isolate beta because we're looking for that particular angle, that contact angle that the liquid is making. So our last step is just to take the inverse cosine of that uh, nice looking um, equation that we formulated. We're gonna plug in our information, once again converting the capillary rise from five millimeters to 0 0.005, putting in our specific weight, as well as the diameter of 0 0.001. So you see there, there's a lot of areas to make little minor mistakes that will dramatically um, you know affect the angle that you're going to kit but in this case we find that the contact angle for this mystery liquid is equal to 70.3 degrees